Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to be doing a little bit of skincare with PERS Dr. Seuss The Grinch Skincare Gift Set that they have in stores for this holiday season. This is a gift set of four. I've taken them all out as you can see they're empty. This retails for 28 bucks. I got this at Ulta. There are four different ones, and these are so cute, so cute. The four different masks. This is the glit Glitterly Gold Brightening Peel-Off Mask. And these you can totally keep, you can totally hang on a tree, which I love, and you know I'll be keeping. This one, this is the Soak It Up Intense Hydrating Moisturizing Mask. This is the Purple Pore Punisher for Pore Tightening Mask. Last but not least, we have Dirty Girl, the Detoxifying Mud Mask with Clay. These are all super cute. You can definitely hang these. They come in separate boxes. I'll show you. And they are giftable. They put a little heart here, it says two. So if you want to gift each of one of them individually, you are able to, which is super amazing. If you want to do a Secret Santa um, stocking stuffers, and you have multiple women or men in your family that love this type of stuff. Um, Par did a whole Dr. Seuss set this year, which was super cute. It was not up my alley completely, but I did love the skincare. I'm trying to branch out and do new brands, try them out, and I fell in love with these. Like, who, who doesn't want these? Like, they're so cute. So we're going to do a, a little bit of a multi-masking today. We're not going to use all of them, but we are definitely using the brightening mask today. We're using the hydration mask today for our video. I'm going to also give you a little bit more of my routine that I do today because um, I do them a little bit differently. Um, I've been trying some new stuff that really seems to be working for my skin. First we're going to go on, we're going to do a little spritz of hydration um, because we're going to go in and do a little bit of something before I do the mask. Rollers. I just got this one at my local TJ Maxx. There are three different size rollers for your more delicate eye lip area, one for body, and one for your face. So we're going to use that. Before I do that, I like to make sure my skin is a little bit more forgiving. So we're going with hydration. I like to do a facial mist. This is a pixie. This is Pixie's, Hy Pixie's Hydrating Milk Mist. As you can see, I'm almost out. That's probably why I'm almost out. Generous spritz. I'm going to put the medium sized roller right on. And we're just going to put one pass on everything. You don't want to overly do the passes on your face. You don't want to have too many rolls. Just that way your face isn't overly done. These are supposed to help. These are supposed to help with acne scars, fine lines. Just help get the collagen flowing in your face again and everything like that. Um, and help with brightening and that kind of stuff. I have definitely seen a difference in my skin. I've been using it here and there. I don't use this daily. I feel like it's too much. Um, but I probably use it every other day or, or maybe two or three times a week before I do masking. I use it just before masking that way it can absorb a little bit more into my skin. All the benefits and nutrients from the masks that I'm doing that way it gets deeper into my skin. But then my skin as it's healing itself after, it can do some more of that as well. So just a quick pass over all the major areas of my face with this. This is not meant for any of my delicate areas because it's too big. So I'm not going to do my eye area or my lips. And I generally don't do my nose. That's 
that's all we're doing today. Nothing more. You don't want to sit here and be rolling your face and end up with it super irritated. That is not the point of that tool at all. Just a few little pokes to help get the circulation and everything in your skin going again. So next, we're gonna go on with our brightening peel off mask. Glitter literally gold brightening peel off mask what i want to do with this one is i want to do it around my eye area so i'm going to go in under here and i want to do up here in my forehead area as well everything else we're going to do with hydration today so these uns these unscrew there's a little lady on them we're going to take this off oh, it's a little sticky i want to rub it it smells kind of citrusy. It smells good though. But as you can, you can see the glitter in it. It's it's so pretty. But I'm gonna use one of my little brushes. The funnest, and this isn't even like this is super gold. I'm so excited for this! So excited for this! Whew. All right, I'm gonna do the forehead. We're gonna do thanks for doing the soak it up intense hydration moisturizing mask. This one doesn't really have a smell. Or just a cream base. Nothing fancy on this one. Let's go on and put a good amount. My face has been so dry. Bummer. I wish they put something cute in this one too. Glitter mask needs 10 to 16 minutes. And the soak it up mask, probably early morning or night. Let's go with directions. Soak it up mask. Apply liberally morning or night to clean skin for added hydration. It says mask, but the way they describe it sounds like you could almost use this on a daily. Hmm. The glittery gold. Generously applied to clean dry skin, avoiding eye area. I guess I didn't listen. And lips. Leave mask on for 10 to 16 minutes or until completely dry. Starting at the outer edges, gently peel off mask in a downward motion. Rinse off any residue with warm water. Okay, so I guess we're going to wait our 10 to 16 minutes. I'm going to do the same thing with hydration. Oh, you can feel it working. I love when you can feel things working. Especially since we did the, the derma, yeah, the derma roller. That I got from TJ Maxx, you can feel so good in it. And my skin needs it, even though the, my skin doesn't look bad. I can feel it, so we're just gonna do this, and then we'll put on some good hy hydrating moisturizers after. So, but anyways, like we said, I got this at Ulta. It retails for 28 bucks. There are four different masks, and you can—they make the boxes so you can gift them separately if you want to, which is super cool. And they have little who you want to give them to pieces on them, which is super cute. The back gives you all the details about all the masks if you decide to keep them. 
super cute, super amazing. Like I said, totally keep these as ornaments when you're done cleaning them out. You can put little trinkets in them if you decide to use them up and you want to put little cute little things in them. You're able to do them and repurpose them as well. So, um, let's, and now that we're done with that, there's another part of my routine that I've been doing, trying with the weather, everything, so much more drying now, not just for our skin, but for our hair. We need to protect it. You get more static. Everything seems to be a little bit more frizzy. So me and my daughter have been trying out Mark Anthony Bye Bye Frizz Silicone Free Leave-In Conditioner. I'm going to show you how quickly how I use that. So I went in this morning, washed my hair as usual. Oh, see, it's sticking to the mask. And instead of spraying everything directly to my hair, because I don't know where it's going, where it's moving, if I'm getting them stuck more in spots directly, I like to spray my hand. It's about five sprays. I like to rub it like this. And then I would just like to go through my hair myself. That way it helps um, with the static, it helps keep my hair hydrated. If I do it when my hair is dry, you get that like weird feeling and it dries weird and oh, it looks like you left like chunks of product in it. So I do a little bit in the top, but I like to focus it more on the ends so that it'll look crazy and frizzy and Everything like that. And it also helps my daughter because she's got more wavy hair than I do. I've got more straight and fine hair and she's got a wave and her hair's a lot thicker than mine because I'm missing so much of mine. Um, it helps lay her hairs down on the top so they aren't sticking up. And I've seen a, a definite difference in her hair. And every morning she asks me, Mom, can you put it in? So it does make a difference that we've been using. Um, the Bye Bye Frizz by Mark Anthony. So just make sure as part of your taking care of yourself routine um, that you're adding these types of things in there as well. I mean, it doesn't have to be a lot. It doesn't have to be an all the time thing. Just we don't all do our hair all the time, but when we do we get to sit down and let our hair down and relax and do our skincare or do our feet or whatever it is that you do do just throw a little bit in your hair too or just know that there's products out there that can help you as well I'm just twisting it back up because it drives me nuts being down alright she's back up and we'll let her up. Sometimes I let her dry down, sometimes I let her dry up with the leave-in conditioner. She'll leave her with a little bit of wave, which is nice as well. Gives my hair some body because I have zero body. <laughs> Anyways, let's finish this timer and I will be back to show you what she looks like. Mm -mm -mm. time has come let's zoom you in I want you just to see how it's dry this still feels cool like it's thicker here but it's it's dried you see how it's dried it's so cool looking Boop. not dry <laughs> but it's been the 15 minutes it's okay if it's not all dry we're ready to get it off. It's been it's been long enough. It says start from uh, pull downward. So we're gonna start from the edges. See how easy. Oh, fairly easy to take off. Some of these are so hard to get around, and they hurt when they come off. This doesn't hurt. 
Okay, Per. Oh. Oh. I feel like. Who's the character in SpongeBob? Squidward. <laughs> Squidward. You can always see where it's not dry because that's what stays. I feel good about this one. I like it and it's so pretty. So pretty. The rest of it, this said we can just wipe off. So I went and got a, a warm washcloth and we're just gonna wipe her all off, including the extra gold that is still here. She looks good. I feel like it looks brighter here. Forehead looks brighter. I'm not even mad about it. It looks good. On here feels good. So good. It looks good. I'm so excited. And then we've got um, this new uh, moisturizer. Algae and Rich Moisturizing Cream. It's for AM and PM. It is Deep Hydration and Moisture Lock. It is from Shiro Science. Here she is. I really love the container that she's in. This is a brand new product. I've been able to use it maybe once or twice at night. So I'm still testing her out. So I just want to show you guys. It is part of my routine right now. It's going to take a couple weeks for me to determine if this is a yay or nay. But I need the deep hydration. So the fact that it says deep hydration, we're going to go for it. Because as soon as New England weather shifts, I go, my skin goes, Meh! and that's where we're at right now. We're not bad. But we're almost there where I'm pulling out all the 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 stops and I'm doing all the crazy stuff to keep my skin from freaking out so we're gonna put her on today so we're just gonna read a little bit that's on here dermatologist tested formula for dry and combination skin um, but I feel like anybody if you have oily skin too I mean this might not be the best because depending on what's in it but anytime if you think hydration is a question, always do my moisturizer. Always, always, always. After cleansing and the application of any serums, apply a small amount of cream to your skin and massage in gently. So I really love the container. So cute. So cute. We're gonna unscrew her. Wow. She smells citrusy. And she's very thick. Like, she doesn't even wiggle. Like, so thick. Which I like. That's how you know they're a good consistency. They're not watered down or anything like that. Good consistency. I just took a little bit like this. I like to put it between my fingers and then evenly pat it a little bit. Just too much rubbing on the skin creates pulling on your pores and, and the, oh it's gonna give you aging blah, blah 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 you're gonna age no matter what you can't stop it all but I like to make sure that I pat it on first that way I know it's evenly everywhere y'all know how I am about symmetry <laughs> everything being even so I always start with patting I don't know a lot of creams go, don't put it in your eye area. I, if I could tell you the dry patches that I get in my eye. If I think my eyes will be okay, I'll, I'll chance it, it's me. I always do my neck, I break out, if you guys have not seen. And once I break out, those things take so long to heal. So never forget your neck. Anything that's hitting the air, Especially in the winter, you guys have to remember. It is so key to to hydrate it. If you have scarves, um, jackets with, with hoods, anything to take care of those little areas. Let me tell you, my skin is drinking this up. We did this, we did the derma roller, we did the skincare, and we're doing this, it is drinking it. And I'm not even rubbing, I'm patting. And it is drinking it. I can feel it. And even my brow area. I shave my brows and those BBs get dry. Dry. So we're gonna pat her at. I 
nose area always gets super crazy too. I usually have to pull out um, my my Vaseline. Here's a, here's a tip trick for you guys. I've been putting these into my videos as we go. The Vaseline now it's not the regular Vaseline. It's the lip care. The lip care is different than regular Vaseline. It is gel based, so that your body will absorb it instead of it just sitting there. The lip care has aloe, you can get cocoa butter, you can get the rose ones. It will absorb, but it still protects it from the air. So you have those areas that crack, my nose cracks really bad. I get these dry patches from these breakouts. It'll protect it, but it also has the aloe or the coconut um, oil or the rose and your skin will absorb it so it can heal. The air's not touching it so that it it's, it's protected so it'll heal quicker. I mean, it's half the time. It cuts the time in half. So when it gets really bad where it's hurting, it's it, it's hurting, it's bleeding, it's burning. You guys are past the point of doing regular care. You need to do something to seal it. It needs a bubble. It needs biohazard, okay? where That's where we're at, where anything is bothering it. You shouldn't be putting makeup on it. I don't wanna see concealer or primers. It's not gonna do anything but irritate it and worsen it. So, cause my, my nose is getting there. So today will, tonight will be a Vaseline lip care night around my nose. I can feel it. <laughs> but as you can see, I'm putting this on. It doesn't feel oily, it feels so nice. It feels good on my hands as I finish rubbing it in. I don't look oily, I don't look shiny, I look matte. My skin looks healthy, it looks good. And it's just from everything that we're doing, we look bright, we look, we look good. I don't think we look extra plump. I don't like that extra dewy look, but we look good. Skin looks good. We have some breakouts. You can't tell that I have some dryness problems going on right now, which is fabulous. So this is the mask that we've been doing. This is how I do the skincare regimen. Today was a multi-masking day. Sometimes I just do multiples back to back. I'll do a peel or I'll do something that I'll detox my skin, but then I hydrate right after because it's winter, guys. It's cold. We've gotta, we've gotta combat. So if you do something to detox, you gotta put the hydration right back in, and then you gotta do your skincare on top of it, and sometimes you need that overnight mask on top of that. So just make sure, if you wanna keep that flawless skin throughout the winter, keep your makeup looking good for the holidays. Skin, 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 skin. And so far, it's only been two to three days but this stuff is great, I don't feel oily. This is definitely a heavy moisturizer. Generally, I can't do the white moisturizers. I can't do the heavy stuff like this. It's too oily, it sits on top of my skin. It doesn't absorb. And this stuff is, it's in, I don't, it's in, it feels good. My skin feels good, it sucked it in, and it just, it feels great. Mm. It feels amazing, I feel good. And I feel confident with this skin. Is it perfect? No, but I feel confident my skin is glowing. I feel amazing. I'm going to go out and strip my stuff today. Not with this. But I can go out and strip my stuff today. <laughs> Anyways, thanks so much, guys, for hanging out with me today. I hope you enjoyed these amazing masks from Purr. These are cute. Make sure you go grab them for yourself because I know I've been grabbing gifts for myself this holiday season. There's too much good stuff out there not to. Or grab one of the four for yourself and gift the rest for a friend, a family member, your mom, a sister, an aunt, a grandma. Make it a fun thing on Christmas morning. You guys can mask together. I would love to see photos of families masking together. That'd be so cute. And then to shirt, she wrote science. She wrote science. This stuff is bomb. So far, I am and love and usually I know we have to, to make sure these actually work for our skin I like to give it a week two weeks tops but generally within the first day or two you're gonna know if you like it or not by consistency by seeing how it sits on your skin and everything like that and so far it's a, it's a go for me it's it's a it's a thumbs up I'm, I'm loving the smell I love the texture of it I love how my skin's absorbing it my skin isn't rejecting it right now and I've done this with makeup on top of it and I've been good I've been good so 
I am out of breath from talking so much. I am so excited about everything we have going on this, this holiday season. I put some tips and tricks in here for you guys as well. So just make sure you're um, subscribing to the channel so you guys aren't missing out on any of the videos that we have going on. We have so, so much going on this holiday season. So much to use, teach you guys, and then throw some tips in there because there's always something different going on. So much you can manipulate and do and learn. So thanks so much for hanging out with me and my crazy hair and my crazy face oh the stuff too thank you to mark anthony and their team we got these at gen beauty um we got tons of hair care from them at gen beauty and i haven't been able to dive in yet but this has not only been saving my hair but more more importantly my daughter's hair her hair she likes to wear down she always gets tons of static, tons of frizz because she's got way more body than I do and she's loving it. And we have another one that smells a little bit more manly. Not that it's bad, but it smells more manly and she likes to smell this one better. So thanks so much for hanging out with us guys. I appreciate you hanging out with me this long and get through all the products because I didn't expect it to go this long, but it did. But anyways, thanks so much. Make sure you subscribe if you liked everything going on. Um, yeah. And make sure you give it a thumbs up if you learned something new. And let me know what your favorite skincare product is right now. Maybe we can test it out here. We can do a cute little video. But let me know what's going on with you. And I'll see you guys in my next tutorial. Bye.